The following is a presentation of the Retro Network. Hey folks, welcome back to another episode of the Wax Pack Flashback brought to you by the Retro Network here on the Retro Network YouTube channel. I am uber excited for today's pack of cards. Uh, I'm going to give you a little backstory. 1985 comes today's pack. 1985, we were in the midst of the Cold War. Ronald Reagan was president. Uh, everything, the propaganda in American news and stuff and television shows, it was always us versus them. I bought into that hook, line, and sinker. I still buy into it hook, line, and sinker. Uh, these cards are from a movie that, to me, was the epitome and the climax of the Cold War in the 1980s and symbolizes a lot about the 1980s. The ultimate good guy versus the ultimate bad guy. America versus Russia. It's 1985, my favorite holiday, Christmas. I'm only talking about one thing. We've got cards from Rocky IV, the movie. Now... Uh, these cards, these wax packs, had two different images on the front. And if you put them together, it's Ivan Drago on this side, you know, their fist hitting, creating the explosion there. Later today, after you watch this, head over to the Retro Network Instagram page where Jason will be doing his response video where he's got the Drago pack to my Rocky pack. I'm really excited for these. Let's get to it. All right, so Rocky Four cards from 1985 produced by Tops. We have nine picture cards, one sticker, one stick of bubble gum. Uh, let's see here. Tops Chewing Company. Uh, no uh, offers for anything cool in this pack like you could get from others. Traditional wax pack. And this wax pack art is so awesome. Rocky, when you see the Drago pack with it, it's just, it's glorious. I can feel the old stick of gum. Uh-oh, already starting to tear my wax pack. Uh, Easy. There you go. That's what daddy likes. I want to preserve these. The wax pack itself. I'm going to frame all these one day. And a big uh, diorama type thing. Ew. That's one of the ugliest pieces of gum I have seen come out of a pack of cards. See, a bunch of these different card packs like this all stretch end to end, top to bottom. That's going to look marvelous. So let's see here. We'll just break these in half. Oh, man. Great sticker. Number 9 out of 11. Rocky and Drago in Russia, Christmas night, battling it out. And then you get part of the, the poster picture puzzle on the back. Clash of the Superpowers. My goodness, everything about this movie I just love. And and in connection, I'm just I'm so far two cards in, I'm loving this pack. This is I've got goosebumps. Most folks, even Rocky Jr. schoolmates, think the Italian stallion is overmatched. Drago's so much younger than his American opponent. See, they told the story of the movie on the backs of these movie cards like that. This may be the first pack where every card is the MVP. Oh no, dynamic punch. It's where Drago, that's the killing shot on Apollo Creed. Oh. Oh no, no, no. That was the real downside of the movie. But it had to happen to make the movie so good. Man with a mission. That right there, that's a good shot of Rocky. Got the red, white, and blue boxing trunks on. Great shot of Stallone. That, that's in the running for favorite card of the pack. Rage of the Rock. That's where he's making his comeback against Drago. Ooh, man. Drago's winded. You can see the, the pain etched on his face, and Rocky is just loading up. Just loading up for another shot. <gasps> the winner. Rocky in celebration. My goodness. That's good stuff. Rocky jumps for joy as both Americans and Russians cheer his victory. The underdog has emerged victorious and Apollo Creed is avenged. That's one thing. It don't matter the nationality of the fighters. The little guy can win over the crowd when they win. Knight of the strong man. Rocky and Drago there. From Russia with hate. 
That's a great, great tagline. And sadly, the last card in the pack, Welcome to Russia. That's a good card. Uh, I love the whole training montages he done out in the Russian winter, out in the farmland. Really nice. But I got to pick a favorite card from this pack. I'm going to go with the profile shot of Rocky Balboa. I mean, he's one of my movie heroes. Uh, it don't get much more fun movies for me than all the Rocky movies, except maybe Rocky V, which I enjoyed. Most people don't, but I, I really enjoyed Rocky V. But these cards, now, they are not they don't have a sheen to them, really. It may look like it in the picture. I think that's just my lighting. Now, they're just a cardboard card, um, just plain blue border. Got the yellow banner at the bottom. And uh, the boxing glove in the corners of them. Just really nice touch. If this had been white, and you'd have had the red, the white, and the blue, I think that would have fit it better. But the yellow does make everything pop. But I'm going with this man with a mission card as my favorite. Whew. Boy, that right there takes me back. And let me tell you another quick story. The first time I watched Rocky IV, I was traveling with my old man, and we were staying in this hotel out in the middle of nowhere and they knew they were in the middle of nowhere and they played to that they had rental movies in the rooms and one of the movies we rented was rocky four this was probably a year or two after it came out i loved the movie then i love it now i've loved it since then until now and those cards are uh just so full of nostalgia for me like i said at the top of this go over to the instagram page for the retro network at trn social and watch jason's response video where he's going to open the Drago pack to these cards. Mm -hmm. Till next time, I'll see you then. This has been a presentation of the Retro Network. For more great retro pop culture content, including podcasts, videos, and articles, visit www.theretronetwork.com.